Hello buddy, what's the whole universe? I hope everything is fine and I'm a Russian and who brings all of them own experience. And today we're gonna dive into the examination papers that will be on my exams in this June, July. It is uh, the Russian Federation exam attestation when you do testing of your knowledge after graduating the master's degree education. Yes, and we'll dive right now into this. Let's uh, look at this one moment. Where's my camera? camera is here okay and uh, we have the list of them it is written in russian language maybe we you will some uh, you will understand something or at least you will compare with your university and uh, in your uh, place or etc Ex all the things all the examination lists it is actually if we'll translate it uh, fully word by word actually it is examination ticket examination ticket but actually it is i think that it is examination paper examination variant examination variant number one examination variant number two it is kind of the specific uh, board or box or the specific realm <laughs> or domain or the specific container of uh, questions for a specific person yes you you will choose one random and so you have 20 uh, you have the list of 25 questions uh, that you can answer to and so uh, we have uh, this uh, kind of it is uh, how it is written it is the actually standard of uh, of all examination lists because in uh, previous university in moscow state uh, University of Geodesy and Cartography, I had the same. Also, in Russian Pedagogical University of Herzen, I had the same. And right now, in Moscow... Moscow State Region or Moscow Regions Moscow State Region University I have the same thing it is uh, they are with the same standard are written kind of examination lists and uh, what are the it, it is for the second uh, second year of master's degree uh, things here is what is written it is actually the Ministry of Education of Moscow District Moscow Region uh, place okay it is uh, the name of my university the uh, I can read it in a Russian language. Государственное образовательное учреждение высшего образования Московской области, Московский государственный областной университет, в скобочках МГО. В скобочках it means uh, <laughs> inside of the parentheses. Okay, it is how it's written. And it's actually the Mosk it is uh, the state educational uh, state educational place, university, or the specific building, building, or the specific place of higher education, Moscow regional, uh, of, uh, Mosc Mosc of Moscow district, Moscow regional, uh, Moscow regional state uh, university, Moscow state regional university, and here is MSRU or MRSU, I don't know. And okay, it is uh, the specific Institute that you have historic historical philological institute. It is where I, I am and also Faculty of Russian philology. Okay, it is uh, where I'm inside it is kind of institute inside of its faculty we have in uh, actually it is I think uh, in your department or something like this house house of russian philology it is kind of smaller it is uh, bigger big uh, bigger smaller 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 sets subset subset sub subset, subset, okay okay Ka it is uh, the faculty actually cathedra actually it is uh, cathedral it's no uh, it is uh, cathedra in russian language it's faculty faculty of uh, of the modern russian of the Faculty of the Modern Russian Language, uh, named after Professor P. A. Lekant. It is uh, the good and nice uh, person who who is uh, kind of uh, famous in our university, at least, or uh, in uh, philology and pedagogy. Okay, and uh, the direction of uh, direction of preparation of the students. It is uh, the code for four of four o one and uh, pedagogical education, also education of pedagogy. And next, uh, the direction. It is actually the whole kind of uh, the bigger set set of education. It is pedagogy, and uh, the more kind of subject of it discipline. It is here, the kind of. Uh, program that we are going it is the direction it is the program that is called uh, educational ah, uh, education of languages or language education language education because i'm i'm the i'm a teacher of the languages 
Okay, next uh, the uh, it is uh, the state state exam, государственный экзамен. Actually, it is uh, state uh, actually state country ca country examination. State examination. Okay, course number two. It means that uh, four year students. Yes. Ah, second, second. So sorry, second, second year students. Second because uh, it's master's degree, and it is from 2020. It is kind of previous year examination. I I mean even more, and uh, it is kind of examples. And here is the examination tickets uh, that you can read. Uh, here is uh, the questions. First will be for the linguistics, I think so, and philology. Next will be uh, two, maybe. And next will be about pedagogy. And uh, sometimes it, is, it should be about pedagogy, about linguistics, and also about philology, and about lessons creating. And uh, let's read it. The modern linguistics as, as uh, the field of... Uh, Science disciplines that are learning language uh, that are created by using different types of text and uh, that are reflecting the culture of the ethnos of the of the folk and uh, new directions in modern linguistics and uh, they are here uh, such as socio linguistics psycholinguistics and etc. It is uh, the question number one. Next, uh, second, integration and differentiation of uh, subjects of philological cycle, philological field. It is uh, the kind of different types of philological, philological subjects, disciplines. Next, create, create the fragment of the lesson of uh, opening new knowledge on the topic synonyms for the fifth grade of school. It is uh, create the specific fragment. Uh, for example, you 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 are you have a lesson 45 minutes in the school or 40 minutes 45 uh, sometimes uh, in most cases 45 minutes lesson. You need to create uh, the lesson of opening new knowledge. Opening new knowledge means that you are opening it. So it is kind of not repetition. It is kind of they are new for this knowledge and need to kind of uh, make them. <laughs> like uh, it is not like they already know they need to know it they are kind of not familiar with it uh, at all okay and need to create about syn synonyms what is it okay next uh, we'll dive in the next uh, the specific uh, okay it is at it is the same actually adverbs as the specific uh, p <laughs> the specific thing in the sentence uh, and uh, the and uh, typology and uh, the features of typology and uh, features properties yes uh, something like this it is actually and typology it is specific types of uh, types of types actually Ty types ty and uh, features of types okay and uh, different types of uh, adverbs and syncretism it is specific uh, like syn 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 synthesis synthesis but it is another word for philosophy more syncretism of uh, of uh, specific types of uh, specific types of units in the sentences второстепенный actually here is it is the background if we will call it we have Первостепенный. Первостепенный means in the first place. Второстепенный actually on the second place. And actually второй means here's the root, kind of root or something. It is uh, the two, two in Russian. And uh, степенный actually degrees, means uh, second degrees uh, unit of the sentence. Okay, next. Uh, and create... Ah, next. The terms of scientific research and specific требования actually it is specific strict rules regulations regulations for the scientific research on the field of uh, problems cases in educational in education of languages language education in language education and terminology of scientific research next Create the fragment of of a lesson of opening new knowledge on the topic, the nouns nouns as the part of uh, our speech. Actually, need to create for fifth of for the fifth grade. Okay. 
Excuse me. Okay, here's uh, <laughs> next. Anthropocentrism. It means that person in as uh, the center of the universe kind of the human and anthropocentrism of uh, modern of modern science about about a language about uh, any languages and uh, the проявление actually it is the examples uh, examples and kind of when you have the imagine that you have uh, the boiling yes it is the verb specific verbs and we have the kind of we have absorption of something, and we have something that is kind of antonym of the absorption. What is it? Let me know in the comment section. It is a reveal, a reveal, I think so. A reveal of this, of apocentrism in in word creating of Russian language. Okay, next. Uh, the general and non-general, it means that uh, general and specific methodological principles of scientific research about problems of language education, okay? And next, uh, create fragment of the lesson of repetition and also <laughs> kind of generalization on the topic однозначные и многозначные слова, means uh, words with one meaning and words with multiple meanings. It means uh, значный, actually, it is значение, meaning. Одно means uh, one. And много means, it means uh, singular and multi. Multi, multi meaningful. And singular meaning. Singular meaning words and multi meaning words. Okay, next, uh, it will be here. Система центричность, it means systematic, uh, the center, that system is the center of the universe. It is <laughs> systemocentric, systemocentricity as the feature of modern linguistics. System of the language as the kind of whole, whole education, as the kind of целостное, actually it is anti-fragile. We have... Uh, kind of fragile things that are kind of Jesus Christ and do have anti-fragile thing. It is uh, when we have robust or something kind of whole thing, not uh, like partial, it is anti-partial, anti-fragile thing of education. And uh, Russian language as the system of the systems. It means uh, that uh, Russian language, actually any language is the system of the systems because you know that when you do mathematics, you actually speak in a language, and uh, you speak in a specific language on the con uh, of, uh, of of the in the specific language, and it could be a Russian language. Then it will be a Russian language as the system of the systems, and if you speak in English, then English language will be as the system of the systems. Yes, you understand. So if you do kind of calculating, you do calculus, you do differentiation, integration, log logarith logarithm solvings, and solving equations, and also you have matrices and linear. <laughs> linear al algebra and also other things geometry geography toponyms hyperonyms hyponyms and uh, also you have physics and different types of uh, chemistry redox uh, it is uh, when you have uh, some oxygen and uh, some of the formulas and actually in the center of it all it is the specific language in english it is english in russian it is russian okay and uh, it is the center system is systematic system centrical think okay thing okay methods of psychological pedagogical research on the example of research about problems of language education okay next create the fragment of the lesson about uh, Generalizing of the topic morphemes, morph, morphemny состав слова. It is uh, morphem compounds of the word. Okay, morphemes actually it is uh, stems, roots, our endings, uh, prefixes, postfixes, infixes, suffixes, and affixes at as a full thing. Okay, as a set of uh, them. Next, uh, media text. Media text as a text of uh, opening type. And uh, term of media text and his uh, main main features and uh, how can we determine that this uh, media text and uh, term of intertext, hypertext and precedent 
text. Precedent means that previous kind of uh, previously created something that we citing and quotating from. Philological, okay, philological education as the part of uh, humanitarian, human, human arts, human education in schools of 21st century. The role of language education in uh, parenting. Parenting is actually the specific term, kind of, when we create some values inside the hearts of people. Of the person, of, of the personality, personality, uh, apparently of the personality of the schoolboy in, or schoolgirl, school, school humans, okay, in uh, the formiravani, in forming his uh, inner, inner kind of uh, spiritual, spiritual in terms of uh, more value, values, here, here is mentioned, spiritual and valuable uh, culture and national national cognitive things, so national, uh, national, when we have kind of thinking about nation, that we are the nation, we are living here, and uh, as, uh, and uh, the meaning of the language education for creating some of the awareness about the national nationality that we are inside, yes, about nation. Next, create the fragment of the lesson about uh, kind of pinning the knowledge. It means that not a testing, actually, it is when you have, you, you had already five, six lessons and you need to do seventh lesson to make that, to make sure that it is already nice and good, kind of, uh, to make it uh, solid. To make a solid, yes, and previously it was solid, I think so. Here is uh, the, 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 the where, the, where, where, where is it? It is here. Is, ah, here, solid, solid education, yes, uh, as uh, solid education, okay. And uh, here is uh, to make it solid, to make it solid on the topic, uh, the the ways of world, <laughs> the ways of word building in Russian language, sixth class. It means uh, again suffixes, infixes, postfixes, prefixes, stems, roots, uh, endings, uh, and uh, words, a doddle and base of the word, where it is from, etymology, and uh, things of this nature. But for the sixth grade of the school. Next, uh, literature, literature norms and uh, speech uh, practice of, uh, of newspapers. Tendency, uh, tendency to the di dialogization, dialogue, to the dialogue, to the tendency to the dialogization of the language of modern, modern mass media things. It is actually it's me. It is средство массовой информации. It is uh, the tools of uh, mass information. In, if we will translate it, but it's mass media, mass media, and tendency to subjectivization of the language of modern modern mass media. Tendency to the democratization of the language of modern modern mass media. Okay, and uh, the impact. Uh, Impact of achievements of psycholinguistics, lingua pragmatics, hermeneutics, theory of communication to the modern lingua myth method lingua methodics lingua methodics science, lingua methodics kind of uh, methods methodology to to learn the language lingua yes Sus and next. Create the fragment of the lesson to make it solid, to make the solid, uh, uh, no, to make the knowledge solid on the topic antonyms for the fifth, fifth grade in the school. Next, problems of the level, level, and uh, also fieldish, <laughs> field, level and field, kind of. Uh, Field uh, properties of the language. Actually, устройство here is uh, the how it is created. Yes, uh, of the lev level of morphemes, syntax, also uh, phonology things. Yes, and uh, field fields uh, knowledge about language. Next, uh, the parts of our speech of Russian language. 
it is actually just речи. I don't know how to translate it correctly. It is nouns, proverb, uh, no, nouns, verbs, adjectives, uh, adverbs, uh, and numeric things like one, two, three, four, five, uh, and etc. And uh, particles. It is uh, particles of Russian language, kind of fish. Uh, yes, you know, nouns, adverbs. What's the word of it in, uh, in English language? Let me know in the comment section below. Okay, next. Uh, the transitional transitional phenomena uh, transitional phenomena in the language the term of syncretism and uh, its uh, reflection in the system communicative uh, uh, <laughs> communicative uh, communicative pragmatic uh, communicative pragmatic direction of language of language education create the fragment of the lesson about generalizing of the topic uh, the adjectives as the part of our speech of the chest reach as the particle particle of the speech sixth grade next examination number eight and we have the sign ah by the way it is the specific particle what is mentioned and it is the our decaying or the person who is the kind of the ruler the main manager of our of our faculty of our department of Russian philology for example, yes, and not for example, this Russian philology written. Next, scientific paradigm in linguistics as the ruling, a <laughs> ruling gospodstvoish. Actually, it is the kind of heaven, heaven's official, heaven officials, uh, <laughs> the some of the god as the as the ruler on the every stage of uh, of. Da -da 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 -da, of uh, development of the science the 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 change the changing of scientific paradigms law of uh, of development of the science about russian language okay something new for me scientific paradigm in linguistics okay as the main thing as the main it's actually main main ruling and uh, the the basis principle uh, it means the super mega kind of the ruling of all it is the lord of the rings okay next the main didactic didactic approaches in information in information society it means uh, that we live in the inform informative information of society of the information okay competent uh, competent competency approach to the language education in 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 our information society next create the fragment of the lesson to solid the topic called numbers numerous it means one two three four five cardinal ordinal as the part of our speech to the sixth of sixth grade as the particles okay particles of the sentences okay we'll do 10 and then we'll finish okay next human as the creator and the storage of the language reflection of the human in the language 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 kind of uh, how to say it language image of the world we have the image of the world for example if you if you are an engineer you have the specific world image inside of you you see the world specifically in terms of it perspective and uh, and you use specific specific words to describe things the same uh, i mean that uh, we have this uh, image for other people and it is a little bit different and language language uh, image of the world okay next and uh, the проявление actually again it is uh, revealing of of anthropocentrism in grammatical structure of a Russian language realization of systematic uh, doing systematic dealing systematic uh, деятельности actually it is do make create build construct it is the words of doings of re realization of systematic uh, doing doing full <laughs> approach in uh, language education and uh, and uh, to match to the rules of 
Federal State Educational Standard. It is actually Federal государственный образовательный Standard. In Russian language, it is в ГОС. Called it is Federal State Federal State Educational Standard. It is uh, if we will uh, kind of it is abbreviation. Next, create the fragment of the lesson to repeat the topic of местоимение. Actually, it is pronounce he, she, it. Yes, and uh, them, their, her, his, yes, us, and others. Okay, next. Ten. Examination. Uh, okay. The main terms of functional grammatic. Functiona functionally semantical category. Communicative registers of, the, of our speech. Communicative registers of our speech. New, tendence, new tendencies in, ed, in language education on the next degrees in, in uh, educational buildings, educational, actually, in, it is this, in, in educational facilities, I think so. It is a specific kind of place where people are studied, where people are studying, where people are taught, the, where people are gaining knowledge, where people are kind of uh, do something to, to educate themselves. Next, create the fragment of the lesson about uh, general... Uh, 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 create the fragment of the... Generalizing lesson about topic verb, sixth grade. And we can look at uh, others. It is actually particles, seventh grade. Next, it is uh, the specific uh, systems. Uh, and here is one more thing and also one more particle. And seventh grade, so also adverbs and grammatical grammatical basis of the sentences. Uh, and to have a lesson for it, also we have uh, some однородные члены actually the the same things uh, the specific sets of things uh, for example we have we have dogs oh no, no no we have animals cows dogs also ca cats and oxes and foxes and wolves and others we have the animals actually it is all the things that we are after commas doing what is it in english <laughs> it is uh, comma 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 symbol comma comma sign yes and uh, you have here okay next uh, it is обособленные uh, члены предложения actually it is specific that are обособленные actually kind of uh, need to learn about it i i don't know how to describe it uh, we'll we'll discuss about it next time next uh, hard sentences or complex sentences we have uh, we have specific uh, sentences in Russian. For example, simple in English. It is, uh, I went there. Yes. And I did do, I did this. And I went to the store. I moved uh, to new country. I moved to the new city. Yes. Uh, and uh, it is specific kind of easy. Easy sentences. Uh, kind of, um, yes, easy. <laughs> and we have also something like complex we have complex systems. It is, uh, I went there where, where there was something and they happened and I was doing it and one other person was doing it and uh, because of it, which has happened, yes, and something like this. Uh, you understand it. It is specific complex things. Complex things again and uh, also verbs for sixth grade and we have synonyms again and also we have synonyms again and also antonyms again and also we have uh, some of the uh, some of the state exams in the school for 11th grades also some uh, some state uh, attestation state final final graduation attestation for the russian language in in the ninth grade and also again Singular meaningful words and multi meaningful words for the fifth grade, and also again the same singular meaning and uh, many meanings. And here's one interesting thing the modern mo modern research about uh, the quality of education in Russia and in the world P I S A, maybe you know it, T I M M S. And T I M M S uh, hyphen dash dash I think so A 
T E D S M, yes, and with hyphen and dash between them. And it is uh, actually what is uh, it is kind of specific standards, uh, criteria, and scenarios how it should uh, be looking like, and how to educate people in the world, and uh, how to measure the quality. Specific, uh, I think so, measurements. For it. So, it is interesting, good, so, thank you a lot for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, do you have something in your country, and how it looks like, uh, maybe you can sh share it, and uh, how it looks like examination in your country, in master's degree, in bachelor's degree, I'm right now in my master's degree, after, okay, right now it's February, March, April, May, uh, and June, and I will be master's degree person, if I will not be kind of, uh, <laughs> if they will not say, hey, Igor, go out, because you have some debts in terms of, <laughs> I I need to kind of finish my, uh, f my first semester things, uh, I need to kind of to show work that I, I moved from one university to another, and, and I need to kind of, uh, finish my things that I needed to learn on the first year of, of on the first semester of inside of this university. Okay, you understand it. And uh, then I, I will go to some of the, I don't know how to say it in, in your language, it is aspirant. In uh, our, it is uh, the specific person who goes to the PhD. I will go and uh, also doctorate, <laughs> doctorateur, <laughs> and things of this nature. I will go there too, and we will be discussing about about it. Actually, I I, I like to discuss. Uh, I don't want. To, in, sometimes I want, sometimes not. Sometimes okay, and uh, I I uh, sometimes don't speak scientifically in this on this channel. Sometimes I do, sometimes not. But uh, actually, uh, enjoy. <laughs> so thank you a lot for watching uh, this video. Have a good day, improve daily, and everything will be fine. See ya.